<laughs> Hi, could you tell us who you are? Sure. Hi, I'm Eric Rosenbaum. I'm a graduate student at MIT Media Lab, where I'm part of the lifelong kindergarten group. And what do you do in that group? One of the things that I did as part of my research uh, at the Media Lab is invent, along with another student named Jay, uh, this thing called Makey Makey, which is an invention kit for everyone. It lets you transform the materials around you, the things in your everyday world, into interfaces, into new ways to control your computer to make music or play games. Um, I also do a lot of interactive music stuff, so I create new ways for people to learn through tinkering with music. Uh, Makey Makey is part of that because you can make musical instruments, but I'm also working on an iPad app called Melody Morph for making instruments on the screen, and I also made something called Singing Fingers that lets you finger paint with sound on an iPad. And how did you and Jay came up with the Makey Makey idea? Well, the idea appeared on a long car ride one day through California, but there was a lot leading up to it. Um, Jay had done a project called Drawdio, which is a musical pencil, and he realized that instead of just connecting it to a pencil, he could connect it to anything. And so that was a way to turn anything into a musical instrument uh, of a certain simple kind. And so what we realized was that by making anything into a keyboard, we could let you transform every, uh, you could transform every object into controllers for any software that you've already got. So a much wider range of possibilities. We're very interested in uh, especially changing the way people see the world around them so that they can um, repurpose modify, hack, remix um, everyday objects and make them into something new. Um, so instead of just seeing this as a coffee mug, this could be, you know, a C minor chord, or it could be uh, a foot controller for a flight simulator. Um, so seeing the world as a construction kit. We're also very interested in more generally empowering people with technology, um, letting people see that creative uses of technology are really accessible to them and to everyone. Great. And how do you envision the evolution of Makey Makey and the way people make music today? One of the things I'm most excited about with these inventions as they go out in the world is seeing things that people do that we couldn't have expected. We kind of try to design for that. Um, so I'm, I envision a future of surprises, definitely. But I also hope to see a new approach to music learning that's not just around traditional acoustic musical instruments like guitars and trumpets, which are still important, but also adds into that mix something that lets you approach music making in a different way that doesn't necessarily involve instrumental technique uh, or learning the sort of abstract ideas about music theory, but lets you engage more directly and intuitively with those things uh, as a new pathway into music making. Do you like working with kids? I love working with kids. Um, because uh, they don't necessarily know what's impossible or have the kind of constraints around what they think makes sense to do or what will work that adults might have. Uh, they can apply their imaginations in ways that are always surprising. And what would you say to all our academia mentors that are using your Makey Makey kit? Be stoked. <laughs> Thank you very much. <laughs>